Hi everyone. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. Here I am back in my noisy, happy little place, even though it's a million degrees outside. Today I wanted to uh, do a little reminder video on perception. I'm, we have uh, addressed this before. Uh, of course, there is always room to talk about the subject more. So here we go. There is no recipe to happiness and contentment in life, as you all may know. Some people who seem to move through life in a joyous, content way haven't necessarily been given specific blessings to be able to do that. What they have been blessed with, however, is their ability to look at things uh, in a different way way from a different perspective so if we can do that for ourselves we can discover that something that may have come across as a sort of a setback can now teach us a new lesson a growth for us it, it would we would grow with regards to that so um, it's beneficial to us to actually practice this, a little shift in attitude, a little shift in perception can bring about such a major shift for us, uh, potential for growth. Um, of course, the universe is chaotic. It brings us circumstances that we don't always expect, but it, and it is the human tendency to concentrate on the negative aspects of experiences rather than the positive ones. We always assume that the positive will take care of itself and we just tend to notice things that didn't sit well with us. If we can actually consciously make that shift, it would benefit us more than anyone else. For example, if you are at a job that is less than ideal but you don't necessarily have any chance of changing it, perhaps you could think of, okay, what can I do? How can I look at this particular aspect that might be more pleasant, might make this a little more bearable for me? What aspect of this job can I focus on that would help me get motivated and do that? Um, for example, if we're tasked with something we're fearful of, we could test our own capabilities of what we're actually made of. Let's see what I'm capable of doing. You know, this is a great way of looking at something that's challenging. Or all the surprises that come our way in our lives, they add little spice. So if we can look at them as something uh, little gift for our potential growth it can change things in our in our lives in such a profound way and it would add joy to it of course it's not enough to just make the conscious decision of la -di -da, I'm gonna wake up and I'm just gonna be all happy and whatever actually that's fantastic if you have that intention that needs to get coupled with your willingness to actually make this shift, look at things from a child's perspective. That's pretty much what it comes down to because children, everything to them is exciting and they go for it right away. So if we are willing to look at things from a child's perspective, change our perception and consider possibility for growth and lessons for ourselves, we will in turn have the pleasant side effect of actually wanting what we have, to be joyful for what we have, and see opportunities in things that seem like setbacks to us. So let's try this out, all of us, the next week, changing the perception every time we see things, something a little bit negative. Let's remind ourselves how we could look at it differently, what other way we can look at it differently.
and see what happens. And with enough practice, it will become automatic. I hope this was helpful for you. Please um, let me know what you thought. I welcome your feedback. If it was helpful, share it with your friends. You can also go to my YouTube channel, The Core Shift, and watch it there. Until next time, 